Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today is Saturday, February 29th, 2020. Polls close in California in three days and a few hours and I'm very tired and stressed. I've kind of had a long but good week and I didn't really know what to talk about in this video so I'm just gonna kind of ramble a little bit and, and just share some of my thoughts about what's been going on. So I guess I'll just start with the beginning of the week. Follow me on Twitter, you probably already know about this, but every year the city of San Jose does something called priority setting where they pick their top priorities to focus on for the year. I suggested a priority to the council member that represents my area and she actually submitted that priority which was to develop a transit first policy which was really surprising and cool. The city council meeting for that was on Tuesday. On Monday I was organizing for that and trying to get people to show up. We ended up getting support from Working Partnerships, which is a labor interest group, and Silicon Valley Leadership Group, which is a business interest group. And the Transit First Priority ended up making the list in the first round, which was really surprising, but also really cool at the same time. And then pretty much every other day this week, I've been really busy with the campaign that I work for. Some of you probably already know I work for a state senate campaign, and as I said earlier in the video, the election is on Tuesday. So I've been phone banking and canvassing and doing all that stuff. I canvassed twice a day, once in the morning in San Jose, and then in the afternoon in Campbell, so I probably walked at least six or seven miles today just from that, so I'm pretty exhausted. But for those of you that live in San Jose or Santa Clara County, you probably know that a lot of our elections are really close. Some people will win by less than 20 votes. I know that I say this a lot, but every vote really does count, so I'm just doing what I can to try to help people that I support win because I don't want to get to the end and have my candidate lose by a few votes and then regret not doing more. And then on top of all of that, I've been working on making Turnout for Transit, which is Transit Advocacy Coalition that I started into a real campaign. So I've been working on setting up a steering committee and reaching out to people and getting ready for the next board meeting, which is two days after the election. So that's been really stressful and I've also been going to school and working on campus. So things have been really hectic and busy, but the election is finally gonna be over on Tuesday. So after that, I'll have a little bit more time. I am planning on staying with the campaign, assuming that we make it into the top two on Tuesday, because this is a candidate that I really support and I really do want him to be our next state senator. So yeah, that's pretty much all of the updates that I have and just everything that's been going on but a lot of good things have been happening and February was honestly a really great month for me I'm really tired don't really know what else to say but thank you all so much for sticking with me through this very hectic time in my life if you're all doing well I hope you all are gonna be voting if there's an election in your state on Tuesday I'm probably gonna do a weekly vlog next week because a lot of big things are happening so look forward to that thank you all so much for watching stay awesome and i'll see all of you very soon with a new video goodbye